Security guards are delivering canned foods to Glad Memorial Church in San Francisco. But let's go back a few minutes. They took them out, they left them outside of our hotel. You see, these cans were left on the side of the building because they weren't wanted. In fact, a lot of food wasn't wanted. So why would people get in line to get food for the needy if they're not really in need? They're selling it. For how much? I don't know, but for a profit. They're turning a program for the needy into a program for the greedy. It's a shame. So let me try to explain in the simplest way I can. Glide Memorial Church, located on Reverend Cecil Williams Way, also known as Ellis Street, every year hands out bags of groceries to people in need, and that's a good thing. But after some people get the bags of free food, they quickly sell the contents of the bags for about $5. Now I know what you're thinking. It's their bags. They can do whatever they want. And you are correct. Except, let's look at what's happening here. Notice a lady folding up the bag that was given by Glide. Soon, she notices me recording and tries to hide the bag. Notice there are about five bags there, not including the folded one. What is happening is people are getting in line multiple times to get their free bags of food. They carry backpacks and suitcases so they can offload their ill-gotten gains and return in line. Then take out the unwanted items. We have a lot of people here in San Francisco that are really hungry and they can use that food. But it gets worse. Some of the food will never make it to anyone's table. Instead, some will end up in landfills. See these ladies by the garbage can? Well, they're tossing what they don't need or can't sell. Here, I'll show you multiple cans of food for the needy thrown away. And if that's not the purest form of people behaving badly, I don't know what is.